we didn't have the time to sit there for four or five weeks to see what animals came, so we put a couple camera traps. And the beauty with the like, camera traps is you can sit them on a tree, and the, anything that walks in front of it, it takes pictures of them. And we set two camera traps at two different areas, two different salt licks, and we had them there for a period of two months. And within the first two weeks, we had photographed this monkey. What has been found is a subspecies, so part of a species that was that has not been seen for a very long time. Um, so that, that's pretty exciting. The species is uh, only occurs on Borneo. It's reasonably well known from the Malaysian side of Borneo, but it's very poorly known from the, the Indonesian side of Borneo. Um, and for years, people would not see um, the species. The species must have occurred over very large areas, and many forest areas, even if the forest is still there, are losing these monkeys because of overhunting. So just protecting the forest in this case is not enough. And having them in the area called Boheya, which is one of these very well protected areas where communities have an, a very effective system in place to keep out illegal hunting, illegal logging, is, is good news. But it's only a small area. And we need much larger areas with that similar kind of protection to make sure that you have large enough populations that can basically prevent people from going extinct.